Over the weekend, Los Angeles experienced a massive heat wave. Did you know that? I'm sure you did, yeah. Yeah, some people were so desperate for air conditioning, they actually went to see the new Transformers movie. Yeah. <laughs> That's how much they, they wanted to get away from it. Uh, well, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> oh! People kind of thought I was being mean, and then they yeah, thought, I oh, know. no, that movie really sucks. <laughs> and then everybody was happy. Ridiculous. Of course, everyone knows this is the big story. At this weekend's G20 summit, President Trump and Vladimir Putin had a private two-and-a-half-hour meeting. Two-and-a-half-hour meeting, yeah. Yeah, probably not a good sign that it ended with Putin handing Trump a single red rose. <laughs> They were in hot tubs together, apparently. <laughs> President Trump is being criticized now because he allowed his daughter Ivanka to sit in for him at the G20 summit. Yeah, Ivanka sat in for him at the G20 summit. At a press conference today, the White House's press secretary's eight-year-old daughter said it's no big deal. <laughs> uh, it's really, uh, it's like down here behind the podium. That's my kid licking a lolly, yeah? Of course. I don't know, I hate to play around. On Saturday, uh, speaking of President Trump, on Saturday, President Trump had back-to-back -back meetings with the leaders of China and then Japan. Yep. It was an awkward moment when Trump asked the leader of Japan, hey, didn't I just meet with you? <laughs> What's the story here? Some good news in Iraq. ISIS is on the verge of total defeat in Iraq. Yeah. Good news. Yeah, you can tell. You can tell ISIS is pretty much on the way out because they've already been booked to appear on next season's Dancing with the Stars. That's how you know. That's how you know. Good things are bad. <laughs> oh, wow, that's tough about ISIS. Some tech experts, this was in the news, some tech experts in Silicon Valley now believe that a robot would make a better president than a human. That's what they're saying. Yeah, I don't know about you, but at this point, I would vote for President Roomba. I really would. <laughs> I'd be like, I'd be so happy. <laughs> and it just comes in. <laughs> would you love that if they played Hail to the Chief and a Roomba just came in? <laughs> Got a little yep. dirt off the floor, and you'd sure. be like, hey, he's getting things done. Yeah, look at him go. <laughs> right. Be all right.